What's up guys, it's Alex, and in today's video I'm going to be showing you my homemade airsoft build. So right now, it's flooded, so I can't really play, but, oh, here's another look. I took down what I used to have where the water was because I didn't want that stuff to get damaged because it was just going to float. So I took those down before there was a storm. And yeah, this is how it looks. It looks really nice. Here's the back of this cover. It's a little bit wet here. Back of this one. The back of the wheelbarrow, I can't really show you because it's really wet back here, but I'll give it a try. There you go. There's the wheelbarrow. You can sit there, and then there's another piece of wood you could hide between. And here's this one. This could fit about two people. So, yeah. This was today's quick video. Here's another look at the field. I will have gameplay once the water unfloods. And I'm going to be doing two gameplay videos here. And then by the time it's December, on December 6th, 4th, or 5th, we're going to try to make an airsoft field. I'm going to try to make it up. We're going to do some gameplay at Black Ops Airsoft in the winter. And by the way, I ordered a run cam and some new gear, which I will be unboxing by next week. So this is my homemade airsoft field. Hope you guys enjoy this video. And I will have more updates for this field because it will be getting bigger. I'll be adding tires, more wheelbarrows like this one right here. And I will take that back there, I take that, that that bench, I'll take that down and use that for materials too. And I might put that green gate somewhere else and add some cover to it. Yeah. As you guys can see this really big fence here, I'm going to make one just like this. And put it back there by that ladder, make it look really nice in future videos. And I might have something like this, like make it look like a sailing theme. Okay, hope you guys enjoyed this video. This is my homemade airsoft field, and I'll see you guys later.